For most of us, we rarely stop to think about what we are saying. Most people just dump all the passing thoughts or feelings of their mind without any regard to the significance of the words they are speaking. Our words and thoughts roll off our tongue without care for the benefit or damage they cause. Words attack and words attract. Your words carry a certain energy that creates a reaction or a ripple effect that returns to you multiplied. There is cause and effect in this world. Everything you say is creating an effect in you and the people around you. We are constantly creating either positively or negatively with the thoughts we think and the words we speak. Master your words. Successful people are conscious of their thoughts and the words they speak. They have control over their words and not the other way around. To achieve success in any area, use words that create and build success. Words of encouragement, abundance, positivity, possibility, beauty and vision. Before speaking, take a few seconds to contemplate what you are about to say and how you are about to say it. What impact will it create? Speak with intention. Are your words aligning to what you say you want to create? Ask yourself, is what I'm about to say, does it align or contradict with my intentions? Is it in the direction of my goals? Taste your words before you say it. If it doesn't taste good, don't say it. Words become things. We don't attract what we want, we attract what we are. Words have power. We breathe life into our words and throw them out and they live forever. Words last longer than people. People and moments end but we always remember what they said to you. Words create lasting memory. Words are powerful. Your words can bring a difference in someone's life. You can build someone with your words and you can destroy them. And that includes yourself. Words said in anger can linger for a lifetime. Words can heal and words can hurt. Words can inspire and words can destroy. Words have started war and words have ended them. How you speak to and about someone or something determines the quality of that relationship. Words make people want to be around you or avoid you. The right words can mend broken relationship. The wrong words can ruin good relationship. Your words can change your future. Your words can change someone else's future. Your words have value. Measure your words. We have authority over our words and we also have to take accountability of our words. We have to take responsibility of the words over the consequences they have on other people. Are you careless with your words? In our thoughts and in our words, we create our own weaknesses and our own strengths. Stop using the vocabulary of a victim. Start using words of a creator. Choose words like I choose or I could rather than I should. A creator chooses to use words that creates power within choice rather than a compulsion to do it. Words may not always change reality, but it can change how you perceive your reality. How active is your inner critic? Would you speak to your best friend like that or a loved one? Then why would you talk to yourself like that? Your words can make you your own worst enemy. 
Negative self-talk can influence your self-esteem, your energy, your perception of the world, and also your health. Positive self-talk creates lasting change. It boosts motivation because they generate an emotionally supportive environment needed for the change. So, here's a simple exercise. In the next 24 hours, take time to pay attention to your thoughts and take notice of how you speak about yourself and others. What words do you usually say? Can you see the impact of the words you use have on you and others? Be careful with your words. Once they are said, they can only be forgiven, not forgotten. Thank you and namaste. This is Nico on the Moon.